before we start, right, I'll let you in on a little secret. A lot of these <laughs> times, right, I just forget to press record on OBS. I, I start the timer. The t I, I start the timer and I think it's recording automatically, but it's not. So this is like the fifth time I've done this and it's really stupid. What I wanted to show you, right, I was watching one of those Reddit review uh, videos, um, the one with the text to speech calling people cow orcas and, and all of that. I still don't know what it means to orca cow. I don't get the sense of accomplishment in orking a cow, but, uh, but I was watching one of those. And then on it, this guy said um, that the kids nowadays, I'm guessing it was a boomer who wrote this, um, although I'm kind of approaching that age myself. Um, yeah, maybe it's, maybe that's hard to believe. But uh, yeah, anyway, um, these, he said kids nowadays are using the phrase clapping cheeks incorrectly. Now, um, first, I misheard this for slapping cheeks. Um, so I googled slapped cheeks, and apparently that's actually a, a syndrome. So uh, my condolences if you're going through uh, difficult times caused by a slapped cheek uh, syndrome. Then I, uh, then I realized it was actually clapped cheeks, but this isn't the links I wanted to show you. So, yeah, so if you Google slapping, no wait, clapping, it was clapping, god damn. If you Google clapping cheeks, they, uh, you will come across a link to the millennial Gen Z and influencer slang handbook. This is written by a certain Mr. Thomas Brandes in a uh, uh, six years ago now five and a half years ago and it is apparently a running special edition millennial gen z and influencer slang handbook um and it hasn't been updated for five and a half years but let's not talk about that and on it there is a list of um obviously this is some degree of satire if you're not getting this already um i'm just i just find it funny that they don't def include one of the definitions of bay on their def on their definition which is um i mean i thought it originated as an acronym of before anyone else and i mean uh, that could be mistaken so you go down the list there's a long list of um definitions here and you know at the end of the list i guess my reaction is just <laughs> okay boom